joyful, kind, and happy. That's how the Duluth community is remembering David Weston, the man who died when he was hit by a DTA bus. It happened Friday morning near Dick's Sporting Goods outside the Miller Hill Mall. And police say the bus hit the 64-year-old and he was trapped under the vehicle. Tonight, police tell us they are still investigating. KBJR6's Kendall Jarbo was at Miller Hill Mall today where people from the community made a memorial for him. Kendall? People left flowers, candles, and cards in honor of David Weston. There was also a bingo card with the number 22 on it, a special memory people have of the man who spent so much time at the mall. He was a happy soul. He brought joy to everybody. He touched everybody's life. Um, you certainly won't forget him. Those who knew David Weston describe him as a kind soul, someone who always made everyone laugh. You know, he was always about the person and he'd visit. Always had a smile on his face, want, willing to talk, and just a really kind-hearted individual. The Duluth man carried with him a contagious smile. Just because he had that big smile on his face, you couldn't help but want to talk to him. Weston had many hobbies, but what he loved most of all, bingo, especially his lucky number 22. We had a, we've had a few virtual bingos through the pandemic and stuff, and every time the 22 came up, everybody's like, two, two, you know, and that's from David. Weston sought connections in several areas of the community, but mostly at Miller Hill Mall, taking a bus there multiple times a week, seeing his friends, and always saying hi. Every time he came into the mall, it, everybody knew he was here. The place he loved, also the place he died. I was at home when it all happened and my boss called me and I broke down at, at home. It was, it, it was just way too soon for somebody that lifted all of us up. Employees at the mall committed to take care of Weston's memory. They're raising money to give him a proper funeral and headstone. Grieving a friend who will be missed forever and making sure his memory will never be forgotten. I think everybody who met David loved David. And, you know, if you didn't have a chance to meet David, boy, you sure missed out. Employees at the mall have created a GoFundMe to help cover funeral arrangements for Weston. We have a link to that on our website.